very good morning to everybody uh, today we are going to discuss about the role of ui ux in bagister 2.0 so i am kunj bihari i am working as a ui designer ui ux designer in bagister so ui as you know ui and ux is plays very important role for any product or services for the company through ui and ux only we can uh, experience user experience of products and services and they really get to know what is actually you uh, usability is the uh, parameter experience is the parameter through which uh, any product can be uh, known so why we revamp uh, bagisto from 1 to 2 so there are uh, some uh, aspect that is a competitive analysis we have and then we have user uh, feedback then uh, brand replacement and usability so we will discuss each point one by one as we know there are many competitor like us uh, in the market uh, providing the same services so we uh, go through that and we find some of the best solutions from there and we incorporate in our uh, new bagist uh, bagisto 2.0 so we uh, basically follow the swart rule means what are their strength what are their weakness what are the opportunity we can gain from and what are the threats they have so we club that and come with some new idea obviously we have some user feedback also from the customer and there are some issues in creating uh, attributes or variation products so we have make them so comfortable yeah obviously there is long time uh, means around there are five year we are using old old uh, visual identity with the brand so we have revamp our visual identity with uh, typography color swatches and grading layout everything we have a uh, change in agile kit we have uh, used now telvin css later on you will get more about in telvin we are, and uh, here we have used reusable components so that it can be very easy for the deployment process yeah by using these about two point digital presence will make us similar all the way in usability yeah obviously uh, previously we try to previously there are many, many hustle in uh, performing some action so now we are overcome that and we try to maximize the user action by a minimum clicks and context feedback in the context feedback we are just uh, trying to uh, make the things means there are many information randomly coming on the pages without the need of the action whatever the action user is needed but now we have given a step wise process yeah this is the section then you have to perform this action so we club that very so what we have achieved in bagisto from 1 to bagisto 2 basically previously we have basic grid system everything is comes over accordion there are many tabs in bagisto 1 uh, page orientation every action is for page oriented and have no system feedback previously but now in uh, bagisto 2 we have advanced system of grid then we have column layout then we have card layout quick action pop ups and let discuss everything one by one now here you can see in the grid system you will find we have very basic information of the order it's just an example we have did all this implementers now not only with the orders we have for same ui for the customers and uh, your products but we achieve with new grid system that is something look like that if we consider order we have much more information than previous now we have customer information pricing even the order status we will get on a first view of the uh, order next so see this is our grid system currently now we have changed this accordion layout which are very hectic in the column layout that is two column first is your main column and then your right column 
so every layout is get converted into column so that maximum information get be visible to the user previously we have a tab oriented layout information invoices shipment are come under uh, tabs then we have tables then we have uh, detail of the invoices but now we have changed that to the card view here we have all the invoices and all the shipment in the card just you click and you will find in the first fold without crawling the pages as we have previously now page orientation for every action we need a new page to perform the action means either you are creating customer invoices shipment so you will go through the new pages but we have resolved that issue just by clicking on the invoice button you will right here to create your invoices shipment perform in every field so we overcome the pages layout we are come with the idea of pop ups previously we don't know what is the feedback system is giving feedback to the user we don't have any feedback from the user either orders or products is loading but now we have proper seamer effects so that a user get to know yeah something is happening in the system so this is all about uh, the ui we have developed now we are discussing what we solve in the current uh, bagisto so as you know we we have come with managing attribute we have now multi filter option then we have we make the variation product more easy then we have a beautiful dashboard ui mega search and reporting they are new feature we have introduced okay so let's come to the manage attribute family previously this attribute family is managed by in accordions so it is very difficult to group them all and placing the uh, your attribute in the accordion but now we give a feature to drag and drop your unassigned attribute to to your columns either you want to make it in main column or right column so they are draggable so they are very useful for the user to create the family attribute now previously we don't we don't have multi filter option now we have multi filter option for products and all order everywhere we have used that and this and previously we don't have even uh, product type user had to recall what product type we are going to search so we have given the drop down here for that for the product searching because we consider that recognition is more important than recall so we gave the uh, idea of recognize your uh, keyword and just select and use that similarly in the filter option of the order you will find a new uh, filter that is today yesterday so that admin can easily filter out their uh, orders creating and uploading a variation product previously if you already used the bagisto so you will uh, get to know the creating any configuration product or a variable product is very hard in bagisto we minimize that and along with that we have given a option to edit those product on a single click as you can see we can select all or some of the product and we can edit their price inventory images on a single click for all the products yeah so this is a new feature of mega search here uh, previously we don't have now if you find with any keyword in the search you will find the product order categories and customer you don't know the order id you just type the customer name you will find the customer orders on the key so this is a new we have introduced in bagisto 2.0 now we have changed the ui of dashboard also in first fold you can find the overall details of the uh, what is going on in your store then do you, uh, you have the today's detail what is uh, you have to perform today then your recent order is there and stock threshold is there what which product is going to be out of a stock not only this we have made uh, actually the screen is small we have more uh, graph here of sales and visitors also we are currently working on uh, reporting 
So we are come with three ideas of reporting: sales, product, and customer. And uh, those uh, where you can find out your uh, abandonment card, funnel, uh, sale funnel. You can find many thing is there. We are still working on that. So uh, this is the more uh, now one more bonus point that now Bagisto is uh, have a dark theme also. So this is another thing we have introduced. So there are many things in Bagisto we have work on, but uh, in this PPT I cannot explain all those things. But gradually in the coming talks you will find more on the Bagisto two point zero.